This how-to video is going to go through how to develop a Xero program to check robot mastering. Under Teach Options, find Select. This brings up a list of previous developed programs which can be selected using the arrow keys and the option to create a new program. We want to build a new program, so on the main menu, select Create. Now, add a program name. We will call this Program Zero. Once the program name is typed on the main menu, select Detail. This next screen shows all the development information for this program, including creation and modification dates. It is important to document the program for other users, so add a comment and then select End. Now select Point on the main menu and then Shift and then Point and using the up arrow, move to the first line of the program. Arrow right until the one between the brackets is highlighted and on the main menu, select Position. The screen changes to show the Cartesian XYZ coordinates. We do not want to set these coordinates. Our goal is to set the joints to zero. On the main menu, select Representation, R-E-P-R-E, -E, and change information shown to joint. Using the arrow keys and number pad, move through each axis, changing the degree to zero and pressing enter to move to the next joint. When all joints have been set to zero, go up to the main menu and select done. Going back to the program, the line has changed. Arrow over to the percentage shown and change this to 25%. Next, arrow back to the beginning of the line and select shift. At the bottom, select the minus percentage button and going straight up the column to the forward button, FWD. The robot moves to follow the zero program. Go back to shift and toggle. Move down to the number pad and select the POSN position button. The screen shows that the joints are now at zero. Now select world on the main menu and this shows the Cartesian coordinates. A program does not store both Cartesian and joint coordinates. Only one can be selected. 